my mouses. I thought for the first thing that we'd do today is have a look at this amazing house. It's basically a Star Trek house. Now that is fan work going to the extremes. It's amazing. Why you would do it, I don't know. It's some kind of obsession, I think. But at the same time, it's an amazing work of art. So well done. You're a bit of an obsessive, but well done. Now, the main thing I want to talk about today is this main news of Kali Linux and their full disk encryption, which, I, to be honest with you, I think is going to be a big thing. I can see a lot of uses for it. For example, I run a company. I think our company data should be encrypted in case something happens. I mean, we don't have anything there that's really, really useful to anyone else, but at the same time, if someone did get in, I don't want them to be able to find tax details or anything like that. And similarly, if you're in security, the police, a politician, or anything like that, then you're going to want this extra level of protection that a full disk encryption provides. However, Carly Linux wants to go a little bit further and give you the option of entering a different password to your main password, which will then strip all of the encryption headers out of the drive rendering it useless. Now you could format the drive and you could overwrite it and things like that but the data on it at the time that the encryption is damaged will not be recoverable unless you've got really really advanced decryption codes or something like that. So it's an interesting idea but the biggest problem I have with this is I know exactly what's going to happen. The first time someone gets pulled up with this and the police confiscate this stuff and then ask them to type their password in, they're going to type in the nuke password and then they're going to be slapped with perverting the course of justice, interfering with the police investigation, and damaging evidence. So, yeah, that's really good. It's basically this nuke option, if you're found with a computer and you've got something like that you shouldn't have and the police want to look at your computer and you decide to put this in, it's basically the password that increases your sentence. Yeah, I can understand why they're putting this in. It's one of those things where, damn, something's coming, something bad is going to happen, you don't want this data in particular from getting out but everything else on the drive is expendable you nuke the drive i can understand that but it's going to be misused of course it is and i just want to make sure that people out there really understand that this is not a good idea to do if you've already been caught anyway that's all i really want to talk about today so thank you very much for watching if you did like this remember to click the like button share it with your friends so that they can see what's been going on in encryption news today and also a weird star trek thing and do subscribe for future videos because we'll be more in the future. But until next time, I've been Zoe Kirk Robinson. You've been watching The Knob Mouse Show. And I'll see you tomorrow.